So I've been wanting to do a uh, walkthrough on a Privilege 615 for quite some time. As many of you all know, it's, it's really my favorite catamaran ever built, or one of my favorite catamarans ever built. Uh, we're going to do it on Anastasia, uh, which is a, a great boat. It did a refit last year. Uh, the current owners have put a lot of money into it, and, and I really think she's probably the nicest 615 out there right now. First thing you'll notice is uh, you know a lot of bridge deck clearance on the boat. You'll notice that it's set up with a code zero, a jib, and then an inner uh, foresail, a uh, stay sail, uh, large main, high freeboard. We're at the uh, BVI char or USVI charter boat show right now. So both sides have boarding ladders. So it's really easy to get on. We'll start back here on the transom. You'll see it's a nice wide transom. Swim ladders on both sides. You'll notice there's a passerelle over there as well too. Down through this deck hatch is the mechanical space with one of the two generators, uh, as well as some of the refrigeration and other fun uh, systems on the boat. You'll see with the uh, cockpit, there's a settee here at the port side. The, uh, the current owner did all new teak back here and it really looks amazing. Settee over here aft. And then seating for uh, four to six. There's teak chairs you can bust out. Another mechanical space down through there. You'll see the passerelle, the barbecue grill. I mean, just a wide, wide swim platform. You'll see the starboard uh, boarding ladder there. And then we're gonna walk around up onto the deck and then we'll come around onto the flybridge. So you can just see, I mean, everything on these boats is just very, very stoutly built. Yeah. And this boat is just so gorgeous. A lot of hanging out areas. You've got the flybridge, you've got the cockpit, you've got the foredeck, you've got the trampolines, they've got bean bags. Huge Maxwell anchor windlass there. All of the lines run back to the um, back to the helm. You'll notice it's just three short steps up to the flybridge. One really unique feature on the Privilege 615 is it's actually a dual helm. All of the winches are powered winches. You've got a nice large sun pad with a cocktail table up here. Uh, satellite television. You'll see all the electronics on the boat are uh, the latest B&G. And uh, we come back down another three steps and we're back on the uh, bridge deck level. <coughs> First thing you'll notice when you come in is to starboard, you've got this nice bar area. There's an ice maker down there as well as a cockpit refrigerator. Large big screen television, very high end coffee maker. You've got the settee to starboard, up forward. Really nice accent lighting down, uh, down the floor there. And then you've got the uh, salon table for indoor dining. Could sit uh, easily six at that table, if not eight, if you move the teak chairs. Port aft, we have the uh, control or the nav station with all the uh, controls for the yacht. Generator controls up top, all the BNG electronics. Going down the port companionway, there's uh, two staterooms. Moving aft, this is one of the VIP staterooms. You'll notice the uh, walk around king size bed. I mean, I just love these boats. The, the fit and finish on the privileges is second to none. So you've got on the outboard side, you've got the uh, the head in a wash basin. And then on the starboard side, you've got the, uh, the rain shower. Moving up the port side, forward, 
You've got the, uh, the master suite. You'll notice a lot of storage here on the starboard side. You've got the, um, the, the head up forward with the wash basin. And then after that, you have the, the shower. And then you get to the master. And this is, this is part of why I love these 615s. So you've got a nice desk area here with a little settee and then up two steps. And you've got the, the full walk around king size bed with the television. Just the, the quality of woodwork on a privilege is just second to none. We'll cut back through the salon. We'll cut back through the salon. And you've got your second VIP stateroom, starboard aft, which mirrors the uh, port aft stateroom. So you've got a nice little seating area, plenty of storage and a king size walk around berth. And then you've got the head and wash basin on the outboard side. And then the uh, shower here on the inboard side, the rain shower. I'm not gonna go, uh, this is a fully crewed yacht and out of respect for uh, T and Rebecca, the crew that are entrusted to run it, I'm not gonna go any further, further forward from here, but you'll see you've got a full galley down. They actually even have a garbage disposal on this boat, which is kind of unique. And then through that door is the crew cabin. That's a privilege 615 for you.